Hello, Hogzilla here again, and in today's video I'm going to cover Money Maker for the New Frontiers DLC for Tropico 6. I will give my tips, tricks, and how to complete walkthrough for this scenario. Before we get started, if you like these kind of videos, press that like button. If you have a question, leave a comment below, and please subscribe to my channel. In this mission, you will need to build up your piggy bank, launch tourists into space, and satisfy the professor on the island. In the pre-building phase, build your research lab, commando garrison, cyber operations center, the three spaceport support buildings, a reclamator by the nuclear power plant to capture that uranium, a synthetic food lab, creamery, textile mill, fashion company, additional logging camps, furniture factory, two automated mines for aluminum, two hydroponic corn, two hydroponic rubber, and two automated mines for gold. I like to build a tunnel from the logging camp section north to the open space. In the open space north of the logging camps, build a reclamator, then surround it with a weapons factory, two steel mills, a jewelry factory, a vehicle factory, a plastics factory, an electronics plant, a pharmaceutical company, and a Teamsters. Be sure to set the work mode to fine filter and the auto replace upgrade option on the reclamator. Over by the professor's house, by the spaceport, build four taverns and two cocktail bars, then start building metro stations around the island. Like before, not too many, but enough for the citizens to be able to easily move from section to section around the island. Over by the solar plants, I built a radio station. I do this because I want to reduce the issues with rebels attacking buildings throughout the island by increasing the liberty. If the rebels attack, then that impacts tourism where all tourists will leave the island. This is especially important as it occurs more on medium and hard difficulty. Once you have completed the tavern cocktail bar main quest you can delete those items along with the parks around the professor's house in their place build a steel mill and a garbage dump along with a hospital then get started on the spaceship be sure to select the comfortable cabin as you're required to send up 30 people and the comfortable cabin has the necessary size to accommodate that now it is time to start building up your tourist infrastructure. I like to build my tourist areas in the lagoon area north of the main area um, that I built up. I build a road right from the spaceport to the lagoon. This allows me then to build the inspir inspiring billboards on the road, which will be required as there is a work mode for space recruitment, which recruits tourists to head towards the spaceport when needed. So build those every so often along the road and be sure to set that space recruitment campaign. In the tourist area, I build some snorkel bays, some metro stations, capsule hotels, hologram fun house, golf course, casino, nightclub, fun fair pier, stadium, and a whole bunch of economy hotels. Be sure to research the economy hotel so that you can use the half room work mode but stay with the full room work mode for the economy hotels with, four, with full budgets for now because there will be a quest for a high tourism rating. After you've completed that quest, then you can use the half room work mode. Be sure that you build an airport around your tourist area as that will be a requirement 
anyway later in the scenario. When you have the money, build the fusion reactor as it provides electrical power, plus you're going to need to build it anywhere near the end of the mission. Please note to keep trying to build as many economy hotels and entertainment infrastructure as possible. Once you have the 30 tourists boarded to your spaceship, launch the rocket to space. Now build a couple asylums as there will be a request to institutionalize 10 tourists. One thing that I have noticed is that if the asylums are not fully staffed, the tourists you select to go to the asylum will not go to the asylum. So hire foreign workers to fill those positions if you need to. I recommend that you try institutionalizing about 20 tourists in case there are a couple no-shows or there's a couple that are slower in getting over to the asylum. After the main quest, you get the pain point quest of this whole scenario. Have an 80 tourist rating. You might, depending on how things are going, you might be at that or just below that. If you are just below that, I like to enact the legalized substances and good old days edict. With the good old days edict, then I will build a bunch of guard towers because that'll also increase your tourist rating hopefully to get you at or above 80. After you get the 80 tourist rating switch all your economy hotels work mode to half room which will effectively double your tourist space as now the total number of tourists having visited your island as part of the piggy bank mission is now the most important part. Having as many hotel rooms as possible is key in getting the piggy bank mission to complete. Once available, build the jam-packed cabin in the spaceport along with the maxed out diesel engine. Once you have the 150 tourists on board, launch it. At this point, you should be at about 95% of your total piggy bank. So you will have to contribute the rest by clicking the piggy bank on the top line five times to get to 100%. There is one final task for electronics and meat being delivered to the professor's house. After that, you will click the cure button on the professor's house and if you haven't done so already build that fusion reactor and then you should win the mission that is all for this mission if you like these kind of videos press that like button if you have a question leave a comment below and please subscribe to my channel thank you for watching and i'll see you next time